Hey guys, welcome back to Fallout 4 and we are here just outside of Vault 111 and uh, had a quick look around in the last episode but we made it out and it seems like we're supposed to go down to this village or town which is basically where our home is and according to the map our objective is to actually go home. Alright, so let's, uh, let's uh, make our way back and I think... Um, uh, our gun is on... how do I make sure our gun is equipped? Alright. Okay, so we'll walk down the way that we came up. Uh, I think that's the way we're supposed to do it. Uh, not just jump down that hill, but I'm sure you could jump down that hill if you want. Now, there's a bunch of dead people here and... Ah, uh, yes. These people would have been the ones who were caught in the blast. There's a woman there. Is this the salesman? That might be the salesman. Left shift to sprint? Okay. It's a... Uh, it's a toggle. Oh, what? It's... <laughs> that is the music. Okay. Um... That music is a little loud. Just suddenly coming out of the blue like that. I'm gonna drop the music volumes. And... Seems like here we've got some hub flowers. Okay. Uh, we got some forageables. And the river is, uh... Not dried up, surprisingly. Everything's dead, though. Uh, I, I'm guessing the water is irradiated, so we'll stay out of it. Now... What's that on the quest compass? It's discovered sanctuary. It's a picture of a man? I guess so. And there's a picture of a rocket over that way. Alright, um... Let's, let's go home. I think our home is over this way, and hey! That's Codsworth. Hey, Codsworth. As I live and breathe. Oh, it's... It's really you. Uh, yes. Um, okay, let's, uh, let's find out what happened here. Codsworth. <laughs> what happened to the world? The I'm wearing those glasses. world, sir? Well... Besides our geranium still being the envy of Sanctuary Hills, I'm afraid things have been dreadfully dull around here. Things will be so much more exciting with you and Mrs. Beck. Where is your better half, by the by? Ah, uh, um... I'm gonna be honest. They killed her. They... They killed her. Sir, these things you're saying, these, these terrible things, uh, I believe you need a distraction. Yes, a distraction to calm this dire mood. It's been ages since we've had a proper family activity. Checkers, or perhaps charades. Sean does so love that game. <laughs> Is the lad uh, with you? Um... I'm gonna say he's been kidnapped. Sean's been kidnapped. But I'm going to find him. I'm going to get my son back. It's worse than I thought. Mm -hmm. You're suffering from hunger-induced paranoia. Not eating properly for 200 years will do that, I'm afraid. <laughs> 200 years. We've got the date, um... 200 years? What? Are you? <laughs> the lip over 210, actually, sir. Or oh, give or take a little. For the Earth's rotation and some minor dings to the old chronometer. <laughs> that means you're uh, two centuries late for dinner. <laughs> Perhaps I can whip you up a snack? <laughs> you must be famished. Just, well, give or take 210 years, which means the date now would be 2080... Seven, maybe 2,290, I guess? Oh, okay, so persuading. Okay, yes, yes. Uh, yellow, easy, orange, medium, red, hard. No rush. <laughs> no rush. Uh, let's, let's try this. Uh, increase charisma to improve chances. Okay. Let's try this persuasion. You Codsworth, okay? you're acting a little bit weird. What's wrong? I... I... Success. Oh, sir, it's been just horrible. Two centuries with no one to talk to, no one to serve. 
I spent the first ten years trying to keep the floors waxed, but nothing gets our nuclear fallout from vinyl wood. <laughs> nothing! And don't get me started about the futility of dusting a collapsed house. <laughs> and the car, the car, how do you polish rust? <laughs> Uh, focus. Um, no, let's uh, let's uh, keep with the information. What do you know? What do you know, Codsworth? Uh, I'm afraid I don't know anything, sir. The bombs came and all of you left in such a hurry. I thought for certain you and your family were dead. I did find this hollow tape. I, I believe the missus was going to present it to you. As a, as a surprise. But then, well, everything happened. A holotape? Called High Honey. A holotape? What's on it? I believe it's a private message for you. My etiquette protocols would not permit me to play it for myself. Any standard holotape reading device should be able to play it back. Oh, like that pip boy on your arm. That should work brilliantly. Now, and I'm feeling sorry for myself. Shall we search the neighborhood together? The missus and young Sean may turn up yet. Anything dangerous? That's a good question to ask. Um, anything dangerous out there? Have you seen anything dangerous? Oh, just the usual, sir. Pesky neighborhood dogs and mosquitoes. Shall I investigate? Mosquitoes? Um... I don't, I don't know. Um, maybe, I guess. I don't know, Codsworth. I... Follow me! Okay. We'll keep the gun out. I got my finger on the vats button. What's all this, then? Found you! Where is that noise coming from? Oh. Codsworth got him... No, um, how do I back out? Um, tab is returned. I'm gonna try. Okay, there we go. We'll shoot you, I guess. One shot, one kill, I guess. Whoa. Ah, no chance of hitting. Oh, it does move through, though. Ah, uh, well, I suppose there's plenty more weapons. Here, but a few flies. Oh, wait, my senses are picking up movement in another house. Codsworth, nice saw blade there. I wonder if we, you can become a companion and I can equip you with lots of weapons and stuff. Picking up hostile life signs. Hostile life signs in this house? Apparently decided we were too much. Oh. Let's take a shot there. Let's take a shot there. I missed. Really? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Why was all that blood coming out of me? Jeez. Taking radiation damage, reducing your max health. Your, your family isn't here either. Okay. They're really gone, aren't they? Um, well, Sean's out there. We can go look for him. Sean's out there, Codsworth. I need to find him. What about stuff? Concord, sir? Plenty of people there. And last I checked, they only pummeled me with sticks a few times before I had to run back home. <laughs> um, uh, Concord? Okay, where's that? There's still people alive in Concord? Yes, although they're a bit rough. You remember the way? Just across the southern footbridge out of the neighborhood and past the red rocket station? Okay, so we've got some uh, directions. Anything to loot in this house? We can't walk through that. Okay. Um, I don't think there's going to be much to loot. A trifled American flag. I'll take that, though. Um, Codsworth. Don't suppose you'd want to come with? Hey, Codsworth. There must be someone who can help you in Concord. 
Um, okay. Um, what? Is that a person? No, it's a Halloween decoration. Okay. So, uh, we'll keep the gun out. We've taken a bit of damage. Now let's bring up the pit boy. Map, mouse one anywhere to add a custom marker. Looks like we're heading investigate Concord is down there to the southeast and we're going to the, gonna pass the red rocket truck stop. I think we'll go through that. Now, we should have a, a hollow tape. Not the radio, inventory. There we go, a hollow tape. Can we play this? Oopsie. <laughs> no, no, no. The fingers away. There we go. Okay. Just say it. Right there. Right there. <laughs> Yay. Hi, honey. Listen. I, I don't think that Sean and I need to tell you how great of a father you are. But we're going to anyway. Isn't that right? You are kind and loving. <laughs> and funny. That's right. And patient. So patient. Patience of a saint, my mom used to say. Look, with Sean and us all being home together, it's been an amazing year. But even so, I know our best days are yet to come. Mm, there'll be changes, sure. Things we need to adjust to. You'll rejoin the civilian workforce, and I'll shake the dust off my law degree. But everything we do, no matter how hard, we do it for our family. Now, say goodbye, Sean. Bye-bye. Say bye-bye. Come on. <laughs> Bye, honey. We love you. They're trying to go straight for the fields with that. Okay. Um. All right. Let's. Uh. Looks like we're heading in this direction. Let's get to that uh, red rocket station of some kind. Looks like. Oh, we can see it from here. Okay. Good. I'll keep my gun out. Let's cross the bridge rather than the water, I think. Uh, what's that? Cram? Some food? Okay. Now, is that music still loud? It seems like some of the songs are louder than others. Let's drop that further. The music isn't as important anyway. Alright, so it looks like that is Concord. This bridge has seen better days. And this looks like more freshly dead people. A raider with some pipe pistol drifter outfit. I probably do want to change what I'm wearing. Currently I'm wearing the Vault 111 jumpsuit damage resistance to rads and electricity the drifter outfit is protection against there we go did i actually oh my hand actually changes uh all attacks have a damage type ballistic energy radiation or poison so this is protection from ballistic i guess equipping armor will increase your damage resistance against certain damage types but not others Okay, and we also have a, a pipe pistol. Is this better than... How do I... I'm gonna compare these two. Okay, there we go. My current gun does more damage, but... Uh, oh, it, it's actually got comparison stats there. It weighs more, less value, faster fire rate, less damage. I'll stick to... Oh, killed with a tire iron. Jeez, this raider. Um, well, you did well. Okay. Let's keep going then. 
Here's the red rocket station. Now, I've seen this in the trailers. Greet the dog. Oh, hello. This must be dog meat, I guess. Hello? Hey, boy. What are you doing out here all by yourself? Do you have an owner? You lose your owner, buddy. <laughs> I look more badass in this raider outfit. Okay, then. Let's stick together. Let's stick together, then. Face your dog and press E to begin issuing commands. Hey. To issue a command, target a location, object, or enemy and press E. Head over there. Press tab to stop issuing commands. Red rocket truck stop. Ah, this is what we've been looking at for so long these past few months. We can close the door. Power armor station. You can now use the workshop at the Red Rocket. Find a suit of power armor to use this modding station. Hello? Where's that music coming from? Let's turn that off. I don't know what songs it's playing. What? Oh! Damn. Let's uh, shoot that mole rat. They're tougher than... So our action points... I don't have enough action points. Okay. Any more? Dog found something. What, this? A stim pack? Adjustable wrench? Does he find loot? Oh, look at this! Pipe pistol, duct tape, ball, peen hammer, uh, scissors, toothpaste? Workshop. How does this work? Okay. Uh, this is the crafting system, which people have been talking about for a long time. Alright, let's see. The workshop allows you to build, adjust, and remove nearby objects and structures. Move between options with left and right and press up to find the object or structure you wish to build. If your selected object appears green, press E to build it. If it appears red, try adjusting its location and yours until it changes to green. Workshop objects are built from components when building an object. Components are automatically harvested from junk items in your inventory or the workshops. Okay. Structures. Furniture, decoration, power, defense, resources, stores, crafting. It's different kinds of workbenches. Okay. Um... I can build stores, resources, water. I can craft water. Defenses, power, decorations. Okay, that's that's pretty cool. Hold V to open the workshop menu while in the build area. Okay, that works. Okay, I don't have a... Where's, where's the dog? Oh, the dog's just... Hello. Um, this is a weapons workbench. Okay. Ah, here we go. Can I do anything to my 10mm pistol? These are current mods. <laughs> this is pretty good. Okay. Mod slots. Standard magazine, standard sights. Can I... Standard grip? Short barrel. Looks like I can give it a comfort grip. Adhesive screws and wood. Improve recoil and hip fire accuracy. Okay, so we got the desk fan, duct tape, and wood. And enter to make. And we've just changed the grip.
Okay. No, that's not... How do I back out? Exit station? Yes. Modding and crafting stations in workshop locations will automatically share items you store in them, but only if you've unlocked the workshops in their location. Okay. Okay, so if I hold V... What does this do? I can scrap... can scrap all these things and does it what does it show how much we have or is that going into my inventory no I don't know where it shows where we... Like, build with wood, steel, so we've, we've got those resources there, wood, steel. Is that... I don't know how to check how much resources we have on us right now. But ne never mind, let's, let's keep going. Uh, we've got all these... We'll take a few of these things. Anything round back? Nuka Cola machine? A Nuka Cola! Nice! A milk vending machine with empty milk bottles. Here's a chemistry station! Drugs, grenade, healing, mine. Stim pack, we need blood packs. Okay. So it looks like we've got all this crafting stuff right here. Now, uh... How do I get you to... Grab get, that. Grab that for me? Thank you. Now, you do come with me, right? Yes, okay. So, where are we heading next? Concord? Which is, um, that way, I think. Is it that way? Let's have a look at the map. Yes, investigate Concord. I guess we can, we'll just head over there now. Let's, um, let's follow the road. Do we run faster with the gun? I think we do move faster with the gun away. What is this thing? Whoa! <laughs> I did not see, uh... Let's take a couple of shots here. These are the mosquitoes Codsworth were talking about. It ran away. Oh, I leveled up. Hold tab to open perk chart. Hold tab. And it goes straight there. Okay. First time leveling up. Now I want to see how this works. Okay, uh, so we have, we can, we can do training to boost some of these, or we could, so every time we level up we get one point in these things, and, uh, oh, did I, you can zoom in, okay. So these ones with the requirements not met, okay, those ones are that, <laughs> this is, so we can actually boost all of our stats all the way up to as much as we like, but um, let's see. Iron Fist, Pickpocket, Let, let's go Strength first. Anything we want from Strength. Iron Fist, not really. I don't really do melee stuff. Armorer, protect yourself from the dangers of the Wasteland with access to base level and rank 1 armor mods. That could be handy. Um, pickpocket, under Perception, Rifleman. Attacks with non-automatic rifles do more damage. To defeat your enemies, know their weaknesses. You can view a target specific damage resistances in VATS. Locksmith. Pick advanced locks. Okay, how about under endurance? Plus 10 damage resistance. Lead belly. Life giver. Gain maximum 20 health. Okay. Charisma. 
basically bartering stuff, lady killer, lone wanderer. No, I'm, I'm gonna have companions. Attack dog, your faithful canine companion can hold an enemy giving you a greater chance to hit them in vats. That could be good. Animal friend, commune with beast with your gun aim at any animal below your level and gain a chance to pacify it. Now how about under intelligence? Uh, the path to your closest quest target is displayed in vats. That's interesting. Uh, medic, is there a doctor in the house? Stimpak restores 40% of la lost health. Gun nut, shoot first, kill first with access to base level and rank 1 gun mods. Hacker, scrapper, okay. Under agility, non-automatic pistols do 20% more damage. Automatic weapons do 20% more damage. Sneaking. Agent of Death. Okay, and Luck. We've got Fortune Finder, Scrounger, Bloody Mess. Bloody Mess, 5% bonus damage to enemies. And they also explode. Mysterious Stranger. Who is he? Why does he help? Who cares? The Mysterious Stranger will appear occasionally in vats to lend a hand. I always find the, the luck perks to be the most interesting things. What's at the bottom of luck? Ricochet. What goes around comes around and enemies' range attacks will sometimes ricochet back and instantly kill them. The closer you are to death, the higher the chance. <laughs> That's insane. Okay. Uh, let's let's uh, go something interesting here. Okay. Um, let vault Tech guide you. The path to your closest quest target is displayed in VAT. I'm gonna try that. I'm... I'm, I'm we're gonna level up again. We'll, we'll get a chance to try these other things. Let's try Vans. Confirm selection. Yeah. There we go. Vans. Now, that means... We can't go into Vats unless... <laughs> uh, I can't just bring up Vats at any time. Only when I'm in combat. Okay. I don't know how that's actually going to be useful, but I wanted to see what it looks like. Let's take these hub flowers. Now, I think we're going down this way. Entering Concord. I'm supposed to look around. Now, Codsworth said people still live here. Ah, there's someone. Let's keep our gun away first. We don't want to upset the locals. Raiders. Where's that coming from? Oh, it's her. Okay. Oh, that... There's people fighting here. Okay. I guess we're killing these guys. Oh, I thought that was another guy. That's a mannequin. Okay. So there's someone up there who's uh who's shooting hey, these guys. Up here, on the balcony. I've got a group of settlers inside. The raiders are almost through the door. Grab that laser musket and help us, please! Laser musket? I'm I wanna loot these people. Where's the what laser musket? Hold on, let me Did I level up again? I'm just gonna steal everything first. Now wait, did I level up again? Um I think I did. Wow. Okay. Um, that was fast. Let's uh. Let's see. Gun nut is definitely something I'm gonna be. Why is the music so loud? Okay. Never mind. Um. I think I'm gonna unlock gun nut because modifying my gun is sort of the thing I I I think I'll be doing a lot. I'm gonna unlock gun nut. There we go. Now, when freedom calls, it says. We just started that. Okay, so how long have we been playing? We've been playing for about half an hour. Uh, these, these first quests are always rather short, so I think I can uh, 
bring this uh, episode to a close. Now, I don't know where that laser rifle is. Before I bring this episode to a close, I, I want to... What laser rifle? Oh, it's here. Okay, we found the laser musket. Fusion cell, leather chest piece, militia hat, leather left leg, left leg. Oh, the, the legs are actually different. Very nice. Flannel shirt and jeans. And these are fusion cells. Okay. Uh, I'm going to bring this episode to a close. Because we have actually started a new quest now. And I think it was called When Freedom Calls. So, okay. I'm going to end this here. And in the next episode, we're going to start up this mission. We're going to grab that laser rifle and head on up and see what's going on in Concord. All right. So, hope you enjoyed the Fallout 4 so far. And thanks for watching. And I'll see you in the next video.